Kick it. Hi, this is the first day of coverage from the CES Show 2008. We're here in the Sands, and this is one of our favorite halls because this is where we have found some of the most innovative companies. And we've come across one, uh, unfortunately, right across from a, from a racing game, so the audio might be a bit of a problem. I'm talking with Robert Palmquist of a company called Speech Gear from Minnesota, and they have uh, won an innovation award here. Um, yes, and so we are certainly an innovation honorary award. Uh, what SpeechGear does is removing the language barrier by instantly translating anything that you see, hear, say, read, write, or type. So this is the Star Trek Universal Translator. Now it's a commercial product. And uh, we've been talking a little bit earlier. I'm astounded that this is available uh, to the public as opposed to government types of uh, applications. Yeah, and this was initially developed uh, for the military. Uh, large, uh, to a large extent, the funding was provided by the U.S. government to make this happen. But it is now a commercial product, and so again, anything that you see, hear, say, read, write, or type. So the whole idea is to remove the language barrier and enable people to communicate. So uh, is, is this working from written text or is this uh, from speech? And so we. So we certainly support speech, so if you only spoke, say, pick a language, Chinese, uh, we could still be having this conversation. I'd say something in English, and we get voiced out in your native language, and you'd respond. That's what we're doing right here is uh, he's saying something in English, and it's getting instantly translated into Chinese. Same thing for documents. If you have a Word document or a PowerPoint presentation, I'll look something like that. That gets translated, along with signage, uh, take a picture of a menu in a restaurant, something like that. Uh, in addition to that, the new product that we're coming out with uh, for this CES is called Inspector, and that's designed for translation of any sort of communications, uh, broadcast communication, so a radio uh, broadcast or a television broadcast. If that's in a foreign language, we're able to not only transcribe it, but identify the topics that are contained within that transcript and uh, be able to generate uh, notifications if there's some topic of particular interest to you. Now, is, is this an application or is this a w that you download or is this a, a web-based application? How does one ac access this? Sure, so we, we, it, it is software and so we're selling you the software. It's either sold in an end-user configuration with just a standalone system, so running on your personal laptop or your personal PDA, or you can deploy it in a client server configuration, so reach back to a remote server. So it looks like I, I see a, a, a Dell Axum over, over here, and I've got uh, got one of those. It looks like you've got some other uh, uh, pieces of familiar hardware as well. Yeah, that's right. And so, again, it's software that's going to run on whatever your standard PDA is. In this case, by standard PDA, we're talking about Microsoft uh, OS versus uh, Palm or BlackBerry. Um, but certainly we'll run on anything that's supporting uh, a Windows mobile uh, platform and environment. In addition to that, of course, PCs. Now, tell me a little bit about the Inspector product. I know you're going to be officially demoing that tomorrow, but we're probably going to be uh, elsewhere at the show. What can you tell me about Inspector? And so again, Inspector is designed for any sort of communication broadcast. So if there's a radio broadcast that you want to listen to or a television broadcast, no matter what language that communication is happening in, we're going to be able to instantly transcribe that and go beyond that transcription. We're identifying uh, who is speaking. If there's a change in speakers, we identify that. We identify topics. And so if you want to listen for... Uh, uh, consumer electronics show or, or new electronics or, or new technologies coming out, it's going to identify when that topic is talked about. It's going to index it and you're going to be able to quickly go in and look back at that entire day's worth of uh, television broadcast and find those items of interest and be able to listen to it. Well, so, so you could have a, a group of podcasts that would be um, uh, distributed, to, say, over the next two weeks, and you could pick out when Tech Podcast was mentioned and who the speaker was. Exactly, yeah. And, and so with that, you're going to be able to zero in and figure out exactly where you're being mentioned in the news. So where would you find out more about this uh, product? So the name of our company is Speech Gear, and we are based in a college town just outside of Minneapolis, Minnesota. Our web address is www.speechgear.com, S-P-E-C-H-G-E-A-R.com. Okay, very good. Hey, Exciting product. Appreciate it. Thank you. Kick it.